All right, guys, welcome back. This is episode number two here on the Oceanic SMP. Yes, guys, we are hyped here to bring you guys another awesome video here. We got some big things in store. As you can see right behind us, we have actually officially started a big part of our house. Now, we didn't time lapse it just because we wanted to get this thing done. We wanted to grind it out as fast as we can here, guys. And you know what? I gotta say, it's looking pretty good. We got some cool features. We're gonna go over here with you guys in a second. I'm out at the front of the water right now. As you can see, this is the view from the water. So it's not really that nice yet, but guys, once the windows are added, once all the floors are there and it's lit up nicely, this thing will look amazing. You can see our neighbors are over there, right there in the distance. So this is a really nice spot for the two of us. And uh, it looks so good actually. Think about yeah, it. so I got a turtle in the back here. It. Uh, it's Franklin the turtle, guys. And basically he's been in our canoe for the whole time. You know, he's just canoe, been yeah. living in there in our canoe and he just loves, I don't know, our canoe. I think he doesn't want to swim, you know? He's lazy, so he likes to sit in the boat and get lazy swimming Lazy Franklin, around. guys, yeah, seriously. right here. Big news with the turtles here, guys. They actually love our beach, and I've decided to mate two of the turtles and get ourselves a few eggs. Now, there's actually a set of eggs right here. They're growing bigger, and we're hoping they're gonna make it through this time here and not get eaten or anything, but we're hoping they're gonna survive and we're gonna have some baby turtles. And apparently with the baby turtles, you can actually make helmets which is really, really cool. Uh, I think you have to kill them though. This is what we have set up so far. A little bit of breeding ground here for our turtle and our house. And as you saw guys, I'll put in a clip quickly of me gathering some cows and sheep for our meat farm as well as leather farm. All right guys, so I'm actually carrying all these animals to our house. We've got quite a bunch here. We got almost five here. And uh, we're making a way to our little cage we have set up already for them. Now I was actually surprised to get this many in one go. And uh, so far it's going pretty good guys. Oh, great. Wolf attack again. All right, I'm gonna get these cows here to the cage. All right, as you can see behind me, guys, this is the cow farm so far here. We're breeding them in this little cage so they can't get out and the wolves can't get out of them either. We're able to get in them because of this uh, carpet here. Someone told us, one of our members told us that you can actually add carpet on top of the fences, which will allow you to go in there, but the cows or anything can't get in. So you can get in, but they can't. And you can just breed them here like this. Bam. And we're just breeding them here, just like that, guys. Making cows as we speak. Look at baby ones already. Yeah. We actually have our bread growing as well, but let's go over the features of this house we're trying to build here, this mansion, this twin building here, guys, a little twin house. And so far, guys, I gotta say, it's really turning out. We're really happy with what's coming along here. We have to go out and grind for the wood, you know, to get all that, um, what? Um, with the birch. The birch, guys. We have to get all this birch here and it took some time. We found a biome with all the birch trees. We planted the trees after we killed them, so don't worry, the seeds came down. We took the seeds and we planted them. So we didn't. Oh, totally we have a visitor. Eliminate. We have a visitor behind a visitor. us. Here we go, guys. So he's actually a not too member. far away from us either. Yeah. He's so a new member. He's just starting out his series as we speak, and uh, hopefully he's been coming along very well. Now I also want to show off here, guys, on the side, that you can what debark. Was he Whoa. He just took damage. Oh, there's a skeleton down there. Oh. You can debark. Can help him. Help him. We can debark wood. Okay. I'm trying to get my episode in here. Oh <laughs> my gosh. What is this guy doing? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> There you go, look, he's, he's adding some lighting for us. Thank you very much. Yes. So guys, if you look right here, this is actually debarked pine here. And you can actually debark the wood by right clicking your ax against the tree and it'll actually debark the pine or any type of tree it is. It's not pine. I'll show you quickly right over here. It's yeah, spruce. It's spruce, okay, same thing. Okay, what's no. he doing? Right here guys, right click and boom. As you can see, oh, nice. it debarks the wood there. Pretty cool idea in Minecraft. Gives it some more textures you know you can work with. Oh, give us a fish. Housewarming gift right here. Yes, you see. Thanks for the housewarming gift. Thanks for the housewarming gift. Bronzy here. A little fish here. Oh, it's so nice, eh? Actually, it looks really nice. We should make a fish tank. Some big features on the house I actually wanted to go over here before all this happened is that this is going to be like the second floor I'm on right now as we speak. We're going to be here. This will be like the main living area, um, I think. We're going to have like the bedrooms up here and things like that. But if you take a look, I think me and my brother's plan is to like extend this out over top of yeah. this whole house. And we'll have like um, a... Uh, little lookout over the water as well. So basically my idea is to have an open concept here in the front. Further up on the top, we're gonna have a, basically a, a patio or a deck on the top, and then have another outline on top of the patio of glass, so it's really modern. And we're gonna be able to jump over the water with yeah, exactly. the roof, basically. Right into the water. Yeah, we're gonna idea. make a little deck as well, guys. A dock, I mean. Deck, dock, same Maybe thing. Maybe a nice cool waterfall from the top or something like that. Ooh, that'd be nice. Also. All right, guys, so we're actually right in front of a cow farm that my brother actually made. It is going very well, guys. As you can see, we've got our supply and uh, we have to do a delivery today, guys. A big delivery for one of our players here that's in need of some food. So actually, let's put that clip in right now. We actually have to feed Zach with our awesome cow farm. All right, so we're on our way towards Zach's house here across the ocean. We're gonna deliver this package of meat here, and uh, hopefully he'll he'll be there. Oh, there he is! I see him. Look there you go. Hey, how's it going? Pull up. 
What are you guys? What are you guys doing here? Oh, we have your package uh, here. We got your yeah, deal. You know, your calling, only you know, the best. We got your. Uh, we got your food. You know, we we need, we need to make you strong. No way. How much? How much steak do you guys have for? Me? It's a stack of steak, sixty-four. You know, AAA the best. No way. Okay, yeah, I have like four hunger bars and no food. I literally ate all my apples from like tree cutting too. I have nothing. Um, right, well, we, yeah, we got we got to have a little, some trade here going on. Okay, so from my from what I've heard, you guys haven't done too much mining because you guys have been no, busy building your base. So I was thinking maybe we could do like iron for some steak, maybe. All right, that sounds good. I like that. Yeah, because I've heard you guys like using stone tools in like the medieval <laughs> age over there. So like, I think I can hook you guys up. But so I don't know. I'm thinking you're giving me a stack of steak, right? Yeah, sixty, yeah, sixty-four pieces. So how about I drop? How about I give you guys half a stack of iron? That sounds good. I like that. That sounds good. Yeah. Okay. Tools, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay, so <laughs> there you guys are half a stack of iron, and uh, brother, if you don't yes, mind before I starve, dropping that. <laughs> there you Thank go. you. Oh, you're a lifesaver. Oh, it's oh, it's oh, it's the good stuff too. No way. Fresh cut. I like it. <laughs> right. Good deal. Good deal. Guys. Hopefully, we could do another yeah, one in the future. You know. Anyways, thank you guys so much. I was freaking dying. Yeah. Have fun uh, boating back into the abyss. You know. Right. Yeah. See ya. We, <laughs> we gotta keep our miner nice and strong. You know. All nice <laughs> mining. So thanks a lot. All right. Yeah. No problem. Back. Yeah, have a good one. Bye. All right, guys. So I'm right in front of the house here with my brother. And we actually have a little sign here on the top of the door. Yeah. And it says, Home Sweet Home. home. Sweet home. So Bunnycraft actually left us a little sign here. It says, Home Sweet Home. Um, and we also have something inside now. And let's check out what that is. Because we saw there's a chest inside here. And it says, here's a gift. Please name the turtle something. Bronzy. This is from Bronzy, Bronzy. Guys. Well, thank you, Bronzy. Let's see what's inside. A, a name tag, tag guys. Nice. And look, he even left us a fish too already. He's pretty good with the house one gifts, you know? I have to say, he's pretty up there right now. Yeah, we still, we still have to name the fish something. It's called Italian Stallion right now. But let's go and take this name tag and name our pet turtle, guys. Now, turtle. we actually have two turtles, almost like twins in a way. Well, let's take our Franklin tag here. Boom, just like that. I got it in my hands. And let's bring it back to the turtle. Okay, here we are in front of Mr. Franklin. Um, I gotta say, here you go, buddy. You got a name. Let's do this. Boom. Franklin. Look at that. Franklin, Looks nice. sweet. There it is. Over the water. Swim around our house. There you go, Franklin. Go for a swim. Well, thanks a lot for the name tag. Really means a lot. Now we can actually name our pets, which is just awesome. Like Franklin, he's been day, here for day one, guys, on the beach. He was here before we started our house. And here's actually, by the way, here's where we we're trying to like hatch the eggs as well. But look at this. Somehow, we managed to drown a boat. And I'm not sure how we did this, guys. We're probably gonna figure it out later on. I'm gonna try something. Okay, so as we said, we did an update to our house. As you can see, guys, the walls are standing strong here. Now, we have to add a roof to this thing, and it's almost done. Yeah, we're guys. We're gonna decorate then everything inside, guys, but the main structure is almost done, which we just wanna finish up so badly. And you know, we have actually been holding back because we wanna do this for the video. We don't just want to be up, you know, when we just tune back in. So we've got the walls up, guys. We did some time lapses, you guys will see that. And uh, we're gonna start putting the roof on now and getting these floors into this house. It's been looking pretty good. You know, there's still a lot of work that has to be done, you know, make it look good and stuff the like that. Landscaping, everything. It's just the rough outline of our like, nice modern house here at the edge of the water. Now, let's take a little tour around here. And guys, we can show you what we did, but basically we added like a glass front area, which will be like a big open area open in the concept, house. Which open talked concept. About before. But we're still have to plan the walls here. I want to fix up the walls, get everything looking good. Basically, the design part is not finished, but the building side of it is almost finished. Exactly. Like the skeleton of it. Yeah. And as you guys know already, of course, we are still adding this fish tank down here. We just haven't done it yet because we just really want to finish the structure of our house. All right, guys, we're going to put in a quick little time lapse of us building our house and finishing this structure up.
All right, so that is the end of the video for today here. The house is finished so far. The structure is done. All we have to do now is decorate as we said. We're gonna add some furniture, you know, all that stuff. And um, then it will be done, guys. We've already added another door on the side. Also, there's something behind the house that is coming for next episode, so stay tuned. This is episode number two here, and episode three will be coming very soon. Remember to like, share, comment, and most of all, guys, subscribe and join the code.